As the community of Piparo commemorated the 25th anniversary of the 1997 mud volcano eruption, some of the then displaced community members held their yearly Thanksgiving prayer service atop the mountain of mud. Sachin Ramsubag tells us more. As dawn broke on the horizon on February 22, 1997, the main road of Piparo also broke unleashing the most powerful mud volcano eruption on record. This left many villagers scampering out of their homes in an attempt to save life and limb. The same cannot be said about their animals and livestock, as the ones who were not able to flee met their untimely death that fateful morning. The Ragbir family, one of many who lost all material possessions that day, tells us what they did every year since that Saturday morning. 25 years is a very long time. Um, we had to thank some praises to the Lord for giving us this opportunity to do what we are doing here today. After 25 years, we'll be doing this every year. So thanks some praises to the Almighty for saving us and granting us this opportunity that we can continue to do this prayers every year. Six minutes into the eruption, the most powerful phase of this sulfuric mud fountain fired up about 120 feet of mud into the morning sky. It was chaos really. Everything here in the morning, I tried to save some of the vehicles and I was then I think they comment, they just pulled just for a long comment and they had to tell my wife and she had just grab my parrot and run. And first as we run, first I, I was the last to leave, first as I run in the sea, folk you know blowing come behind me. 25 years later, many persons, both foreign and local, visit the site. Some to observe the acres of black sulfuric rich mud, while others bask in the cool breeze as expected 700 feet above sea level. But Mr. Ragbir says villagers must always remain vigilant. Uh, I born and go here and, and, and never expected it to happen, so there's also always a possibility that it will happen again. Sachin Ramsubag for TTT News.